Good morning. It is Monday, March 13th. Very difficult for me to believe that. Uh, what I mean by that is that this year, well, it's already, what, two and a half months in. <clears throat> I uh, I got up at 5.30 today. It's 6.30 a.m. right now. And uh, iced coffee. <laughs> I haven't made one of these in a long time. I bought them. I haven't made them. It's good. It's black. Uh, I made a video a while ago, a couple of years ago, maybe. I was saying that I was sincerely looking forward to going to the dentist. Well, today I am, uh, I'm going to, to a family doctor, my family doctor. And, uh, what they do, I guess is, I think it's called they irrigate or, uh, they flush your ear. I've had an ongoing problem, uh, particularly with my left ear, for months. <laughs> I've been very stubborn about getting help. I have had it flushed, and it does. It did work. But anyway, I wanted. I want to get that done. And I, honestly, I mean, it's not a pleasant experience, but I'm looking forward to it because it does. It affects your balance. To, you know, you can't hear people properly. Blah 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 blah. I'm not going to gripe about it, but I'm happy that it's being done today. And if not, he'll send me to a specialist. Hopefully get it resolved. Uh, the reason why I'm saying that too is uh, I was, I was kind of lying in bed and I, I, I felt um, I was thinking about a lot of things that I wanted to get done. <laughs> I've been in a slump, I'll admit that. I've been sleeping. Well, who's the guy at? Rumpelstiltskin. I would be sleeping sometimes 10 or 12 hours. I'm not normally like that. I guess this time of year, I just, I haven't had enough to do. So I'm trying to get things going. I figure it's a Monday morning. I always have that in my head, right? Start fresh on a Monday. It doesn't really matter what day or which day, but I choose Mondays off. Try to get things going again. And uh, let's see. So I got to head into Peterborough to do that. I'm going to try to uh, try on some rollerblades, actually, that, I've, that were given to me as part of, uh, I guess, a gift uh, for some rentals that I was helping with uh, in the area here uh, last summer. I'm going to try them out. I'm not sure if the, uh, I haven't even looked outside yet, but uh I'm excited to try that out. I haven't rollerbladed since I was probably about, I don't know, 15? <laughs> a long time. So it'll be interesting to see if I don't fall flat on my face. I have to get some knee pads. Uh, <laughs> that'll be fun. There's a good trail network here where I'm at. And it's not hilly. So you could just, you could rip around down there. It'd be great fun. I don't see people rollerblading much anymore. It was very popular, I remember, in the mid-90s. Maybe even a little after that. Okay, what else here? I got to get things going, like I said. I mean, I'm just kind of, this is kind of like a general update video. I have been doing a lot of um, practicing on my, on my practice pad. Uh, uh, drumming. And uh, trying to network with some musicians. But I haven't followed through, you know, I, we'll talk about something and generate some ideas and then I'll talk about different ideas that I have for uh, projects using my drum kit, which I don't even have, which is a whole other, well, I, I don't have it at my apartment. It's not physically here, but that's a whole other can of worms. And yeah, I mean, I got I to gotta follow through. I have started playing darts. <laughs> which is kind of fun uh, at a place in Peterborough. It's great. Uh, I'm thinking about an art class. I've been trying to do some art stuff too. Uh, mostly fo photography. Um, I think actually I'm gonna I'm gonna cap this video off this way. This iced coffee is delicious though, by the way, man. A little plug to PC Coffee. Uh, it's actually very good. Is reasonably priced. It was on sale too. Um, <clears throat> so I'm going to see. I'm going to turn this around here. Okay. So. Uh, yeah. I did make a video. 
months ago. Maybe there's too much reflection. No, that's okay. Um, <clears throat> so this here, again, that's the, the same the same Reno project that I was working on. This um, wooden piece here. I don't know what you would call that plaque or wooden plaque or something. Was just was just lying uh, lying around in the in this guy's shed, and I had seen it, and then another fella was helping remove a tree, uh, cut down a tree, or fell a tree. He said, yeah, you should paint that up. This fellow's an artist. Or not paint it up. He said, you should clean it up and frame it. <laughs> so I finally got around to that. I used a very fine sandpaper. I put a finish on it. It's this light here, man. Hold on a second. Uh, got a little tour of my place while I'm at it. Trying to, there we go, that's better. Okay, so, apologies about that. That's not even that much better. <laughs> but you get the idea. So, that was fun. Um, and I'll likely show some other uh, little art projects and stuff that I'm doing. But yeah, I'm going to look into that art class. And try to get... Uh, turn this back on my... Try to get some ideas going. Um, like I had thought about helping people with... Uh, like smartphones, like this, right? And uh, again, I never followed through on it. I think it's a great idea. There's a demand for it. I'm not saying I'm a tech uh, wizard, but obviously I was hired by uh, a call center to or a company to provide tech support. So I do know what I'm doing to an extent. I wouldn't consider myself expert level, but, you know, decently savvy at this point. And that's a relatively new thing. So, yeah. I guess I'll, I'll cap it off like this, actually. I'll make an admission. So, I had a lot, as, as everybody did, at the beginning of the, the COVID stuff, which, again, I think I'm making this video partially because it's, I think it's literally almost to the day, three years ago, that I found out about that, uh, or that it was on the news. And, uh... Yeah, I, I had so I was so, one friend of mine described it as high functioning anxiety. I had so much anxiety that I just kept working, working away at little stuff. That was the only way I could really function when I was locked up. Well, essentially locked up in my apartment, right? But what I'm going to get to is that I think I had burnt so much steam doing various things, moving and ver various little things, right? It's not like I've been working 90 hours a week or anything like that. Not even close. But I think it just, it took a toll. It's taken its toll. And I need to regroup in a big way. So, uh, yeah, it's, I don't know, good time of year to do it. It's 6.30 a.m. on a Monday. Uh, yeah, have a great day. Get this coffee here for this. <laughs> Have a great day. Cheers.